Hi, this is Andrew Terranova. I hope I'm looking suitably mad scientist enough today to show you uh, my latest creation, Viz the Clank. Let's take a look. Viz is inspired by uh, creations of Agatha Heterodyne of the webcomic Girl Genius. And he's a little clank. Let me just show you. He's, uh, he's RC operated right now. And uh, let's see if I can do this with one hand. You can look up and down. Get you close up. There's a, his eyes are two axis gimbals, and each eye can move left and right independently, and then they move up and down together. And by coordinating motion, you can uh, give them a pretty lifelike look. Checking this out. Uh, inside, let's see if I can open them up. Might have to uh, re-hot glue them closed afterwards, but let me turn them off first. Sorry, Viz. Time for some vivisection. as gentle as I can. There we go. There's some hot glue. There we go. Okay. So inside, we have three servos. One, the servo runs the uh, up-down motion. And I'll try to get in close there. Hopefully you can see it. What I've done is I've um, hot glued uh, um, three little sticks. They're actually uh, cut down um, toothpicks uh, to form like a sort of a little fork, which I don't know how well you can see the detail there. But um, those sit on either side and, and just in the middle of uh, a bend in the wire. So that makes the up-down motion possible. Let me see if I can actuate it from the outside. So that lets this move up and down. Um, down. Or actually it tilts the eyes up when you move the lever down. Or up. I'm sorry, I know you can't see that that well. Okay, here this little blue box is the RC receiver. These two uh, micro servers, servos, um, just have a little, uh, the regular little um, arm servo horn. And then I've just stuck a piece of electrical wire uh, through the end hole of the servo horn. And that goes up and it sits through a bent pin in the back of the eyeball. And uh, although that's not completely rigid, it's rigid enough to get a left-right eye motion when the servo moves. And that's really all that uh, all it is. Let's see. I'll try to turn them on. And so you can actually see it in motion from here. Let's see. Brace that there. And I will move him around. Here's the up down. Up down. You can hear uh, me reaching a limit there of the mechanical construction. That's up down. Here's left right. See the uh, electrical wire, gray electrical wire on the left, flexing a little bit, but it's okay. Still enough to move the eyeball. Here, you can see on that left eyeball the pin, which I've got bent over in kind of a U shape. It's stuck in the back of the polymorph eyeball, and that uh, that lets that be controlled. Thanks, Viz. All right, that's all.